fact, he's picked well, a completely different one out. Oh, but a little bit dangerous early doors. Just fallen short of the blue, so and I think the brown might be in the way now to come round the table. Just missed it. Played it well. Played it very well. Long gap since the World Championship, but even before that. He uh, was losing early on, lost first round at the Crucible to Jackson Page, so been a long time coming. Just to say, by the way, table two, it's an all-Scottish clash. Graham Dot fraser patrick is the first match there. He is that it's going to be there. Yeah, there was some discussion about... 21. Yeah, Barry played a nice shot there to free the black spot. Very dangerous in this position this morning. Now needs a precise positional shot off this black. Which I think he's got. Judging by the body language. Yeah, again, the face tells you, doesn't it, that he's on this red. 37. This is what he was doing this morning when a chance came. If, if there was a mistake from Enochity, he just punished. 45. Yeah, this is like a 45. practice session. They'll just spread the balls out around the black. Not much to do, just control the cue ball. Keep leaving yourself a little angle on the black each time. Fifty-two. This one goes, it opens up the other two as well. Fifty-three. It may have just come a little bit straight, so a possible lifeline. Way more difficult, made to look 61. very easy. Yeah, he looks at pretty much 54 the lead, 51 on, so in. 69. Crucible. Missed that. So 55 the lead. By Hawkins. 43 on. 69, 69 the break from yeah. Hawkins. And the frame. The late fan Hawkins. stays in his seat. One. Just didn't get it in clean. That's why he's lost position. The bolt cushion. In the first frame, Mr. Brown. Last shot. Yeah, and I think you can't gift Barry Hawkins chances, as we've already seen. One. Not sure if the pink will spot, and if it does, will it will it still pot afterwards? Oh, 
seven. That was enough. This needs to be accurate though. Thank you. Fifteen. Nineteen. Yeah, just come a little bit straighter than he wanted. May have to cannon that red out of the way and hold for the pink in the opposite centre. Twenty. Like you say, so far it's similar to that, that break he made against Lockerty earlier. 26. Don't, I'm not sure he came here expecting that much, but sometimes that's not a bad thing. He certainly, when I spoke to him earlier, didn't seem to be putting pressure on himself. Yeah, it's a weird one when you come here and you know you, you bang in form and things don't quite go your way. It can lead to a little bit of frustration, but... Barry looks in great touch considering he's not been practicing properly. Well, uh, unless they've got tables outdoors in wherever he's been, Tenerife or somewhere. <laughs> the great cliche of snooker players is they're all sort of pasty faced because they spend all their time indoors. Well, fair to say, Barry, quite rightly, has been enjoying the break. And he's been enjoying the, being, enjoying the breaks he's been making today as well. But again, no problem. Forty. Forty one. To bet he's potted more pinks than anyone else in this composition so far. Yeah, his favourite colour, it seems. 47. You sometimes hear 48. that he's underrated, but the question is who by? Certainly not any of the players. They all know how good he is. The other thing you hear about him often, Thomas at the home nations, you see him at quarterfinals, he comes 54. through below the radar. And again, all that really means is he hasn't always been given the TV table. Doesn't mean he hasn't been playing well. Yeah, I said earlier, Barry, 55. he never seems to slip below that 8.5 out of 10. And then when he, when he finds the 9.5 out of 10, that's when he'll win comps. The longer the matches, the harder he is to beat. Because he never seems to play poor. Another superb positional shot. 61. They look like nothing, but there's a foot between the balls every shot he plays. 62. Just mixing it up with the black. 76. Well, the break ends there. He would have liked Bio to send you. You can see.